Okay, today I'm playing the Adventure Land, the Secret of Red Eye. And I must say, it's the first time we're playing as a female character. Not the first time, but at least this female character looks very good. Okay, so when they greet us, they say, oh, hello, transfer student. That's, that's our identity now, that we are a transfer student. So we have to turn on the light. We don't know what's happening, but there is a epic music going on. Kind of trying to solve the mystery before it even started. I don't know if I would put it here. But the mystery has started, so... Maybe it's too soon. Once we get the idea that we have to go, yeah, this... Now that the students are missing, now let's go find the missing students and the uh, music and those kind of stuff. Need to start now, maybe? I don't know. I'm not the best for these kind of comments. And we have these way paths with the lights trying to tell us that where we need to go. So yeah, let's follow them. So they made it kind of easy. So we come to these first students. I don't know if they are counted as students or not, but we know that something's wrong. Did you see the red eyes? Let me go up. Yeah, the, their eyes are red. Come on, look up. Yeah. Something's wrong. Oh, we have to solve this mystery. Whoa. And we have to get to this room. At first, I was here, so I'm like trying to unlock the door. But I didn't know that those digits are showing up there. So yeah, the first time I missed it, maybe they could have place it lower on this box or somewhere or i don't know some somehow easier for us not to miss it but it's easy the first time you come here you would know that you have to put in the date am i putting in the date yes <laughs> a good thing it's 2029 we don't have to like keep pressing but sandbox should make up a newer system for this digits and stuff it's I don't know, it's not very good to just keep pressing those options and there are only four. And it's not fast with the new dialogue boxes, so it's gonna take time. So we unlock this room. Then we are like fascinated with this desk that there is some mask on it. Then we come to the lockers. I didn't try the other lockers, I tried this one, nothing in it. So I know the answer is seven now. So we find a clue here. And we gotta talk to someone who just randomly appears. So she tells us go to the health, uh, the medicine room. So we go to the school's medicine room. And we find a book. I don't know what's written in it. Then there is somehow a reporter here. Just checking things, trying to report and stuff. The, the characters look good. And he gives us a key. So why did the reporter have the key? I know they are always like looking around and taking stuff, but yeah. So we find the secret passage. At this point, things are changing. We see oh, a bunch of guys here. This was scary. The first time it crashed for me, so I'm like, whoa, it's gonna be like full of actions. But then uh, we just walk past him. Nothing so difficult about it, and you can fall in the water. Yeah, nothing. I thought something dangerous is gonna happen. So then we get to the mask guys and somehow we get unconscious and end up in this room. So we have to find the key for this. And so you have to open this door. You have to look for a password and you come here. Old diary pops out. You read the 4324, yeah? <laughs> what was it? It went so fast. Yeah, 4324. So then you know the passcode for it. 4, 3, 2, 4. Why not? Why not? You open the door. There's a guy here. You shouldn't be touching, but yeah, why not? So you grab the keys and try to head out from this room. Which I don't know if these are blood or some other stains that would come from a human body. So it says we need a ladder. Ladder is there. 
we take the ladder we put it up there and you go so you're escaping this facility i'm am i am i sitting down come on okay somehow i'm stuck yeah i'm crawling now last time i think i could do it without yeah i can do it crouching no need to crawl but it happens so we get past those rooms and we see this funny guy what do you want so he says yeah go grab the torch so this um, this experience usually tells you to do something then say oh you can't do it but first you have to do that then do this yeah this keeps happening a lot I mean, sometimes just let us be you know okay so there are these uh, red eye guys looking around it's a dark place it's it's pretty scary i would say so if you don't know where you're going you would end up hitting these guys but it's a fast exit good thing it finished it was too dark for me and this guy is here ah they use those ducks uh -huh, that's how they come okay they gave us a very weak sword actually but i'm gonna equip this because why not damage is not that high we have to rescue those but unfortunately as usual in the movies and the games the wrong door always opens so we have to kill a bunch of these guys to get a key okay this is the first time that so many guys are attacking at once the first time I played, there was only two, I think. Then I had to respawn more. So, oh, yeah, this guy always has the key. King bug. Okay, this is the king bug. I don't know if the rest were king bugs too. So we get the key and we start. Are you a king bug? No. So we save everyone. These are some students locked up for experimentation. I'm guessing. So that's it we save the day and you're trying to go out then it said ah oh, you want to go underground why not so the the experience actually evolves and changes the time to time and it's nice to have it like this so then you grab a usb if you grab it yes finally you grab it to make the vaccines so you stick the usb here and you get the ingredients so you have to bring it and put it in these so for ingredients you have to go shopping so that's the second one which we don't want it now each room has different ingredients i don't know what happens if you place the wrong ingredients but i'm guessing nothing will happen and you have to empty the blender so you put this inside grab the next one which is this and the last one is actually water so yeah it doesn't look like water but you go to the taps here and get the water here it's a very slim bottle but it is the vaccine i don't know why this song changed so drastically here oh okay i have to press manufacture start manufacturing we get the vaccine and we save the day but obviously it's not over it's never over so you have to go talk to these guys they're still scared look at their eyes they are scared you can tell they're scared thing that you need to do something with this. another big guy oh yeah this big guy you have to kill this big guy and he's never looking at you i mean i have to get in front of him to see how he looks okay so he's strong so he did a good damage we get the key card and we open the garage door you always think that it's finished but then again oh the mask guy so the real guy is here it's young kung xiu the final battle of lamia and we have to kill that i don't know how actually this is working so there are a bunch of things here that you can for purification i think if you don't purify and we don't see the health bar on this so i'm just assuming i'm hitting it and the more i hit 
Divinity it is. Okay, I, I'm dead. <laughs> but usually that's how bosses work. You keep damaging them until they die. So I'm just clicking away. I don't know if this is the way or not. The first time I played it, I was killing some scorpions. But this time, just going straight for the boss. Maybe it's not working and I have to change strategy. Okay, let's let's grab it. Okay, yeah, the scorpions are here. I'm gonna die. Okay, my power is up, but the power changes four damage to five damage, so it's not that much. Maybe I have to purify the place. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. I keep dying. I still don't know what's the logic behind this boss. I'm just trying to purify the place. Nothing seems to work. Then suddenly everything works. So yeah, I'm just going at it. I don't see any health bar, but last time I finished this game, I just keep hitting the guy. it's gonna work this time let's kill some scorpions just in case they want us to kill us scorpions hey, hey. And i don't know if we are resetting or everything we have done previously is counted for yeah but since i can't find the reasoning behind this it's a little frustrating just clicking on this. Okay, it's finally dead. So, yeah. What happened? How did I win? I don't know. I just hit it. Maybe someone can try with a better sword. Maybe it's going to be faster. And you know, at the end, it's not finished. So, the guy rounds away. And we have a bunch of cool stuff. Oh, maybe these come for the next events. Then you go here. We want to chase. Oh, it's out of fuel. We'll get the fuel. Why? Look, we got the fuel. Now happy? Yes, now they're happy. So that's it for this experience. It wasn't bad. I mean, if we get to the final, yes. Yeah, the secret of the red eye. The first chapter is over. Let's hope for a better chapter next time.